A new group is rallying in New York in favor of those who want to build an Islamic cultural center and mosque near Ground Zero. Teach us the meaning of truly hallowed ground. The new group is calling themselves New York Neighbors for American Values. The group includes Muslim, Christian, and Jewish religious leaders, along with the New York Civil Liberties Union. Also in the group are some 9-11 family members, like Donna Marsh O'Connor, whose pregnant daughter was killed in the World Trade Center. We do not say to Americans of any descent, no, you can't practice freedom of religion here. Blended in among the press covering the rally was Pamela Hall. She's with a group called Stop Islamization of America. She opposes the cultural center and mosque and videotapes and monitors those who favor it, including Imam Faisal Abdul Rauf. We have really wanted to just plead with him to look for another location to heal by looking for another location and to please stop with the um, ad hominem attacks accusing people of being racist and hate mongers. As this local land use issue has turned into a national debate, those for and against the cultural center and mosque gather daily outside the old Burlington Coat Factory building here, two blocks from Ground Zero, where inside, Muslims have been holding prayer services for some time now. One block closer to Ground Zero is St. Peter's, the city's oldest Catholic church, decorated with a metal cross from the wreckage of the World Trade Center. Organizers of the community center and mosque are hoping if they build a $100 million structure here, it will also become a landmark of Lower Manhattan. Ted Chaffrey, The Associated Press, New York.